trying to hook up a 20 pound tank to your buddy heater and you can't figure out which hose to use or if you need a filter or not, this video is for you. Now there are a ton of hoses to choose from that Mr. Heater builds themselves. There are ones with regulators, without regulators, some that need a filter, don't need a filter. What do I do with this filter? Why is it even on there? Let's answer some of those questions. First off, the filter is the deal where these are all, you know, high pressure propane. And when that high pressure runs through these hoses, it'll make them kind of shed some oils and just different little grime and stuff. You don't want that grime and oil to get into your heater because it'll plug the little orifice that is doing the pilot light. That's where the filter comes in. And so the filter, it screws on to the regulator right here, followed by one of these hoses, and then the hose connects to the propane tank. The bad part about that is you're supposed to replace these filters every year and they're around 10 to $15, so it's gonna kinda add up over the years. So I would try to get the hoses that don't need fuel filters. Now which ones are those? Let me tell you. We've got a few different ones. We have some that are gonna be, have a quick coupler on them, kinda like an air hose, and then they have that regulator. That regulator makes it go from high pressure to low pressure, so now this hose is not sending grime into your unit. There's also a special hose that Mr. Heater makes. I'll leave a link for both this one as well as that special one. It has the same ends as this one, but it's a high pressure hose that will not leach out that oil. I would say it's probably your best option because the Big Buddy Heater is the only one that's got the coupler on it. The Little Buddy and then their new Flex Buddy, they just have the screw in option on them. So if you get this, specially designed Mr. Heater hose. It's a 10 foot hose. It has these two ends on it, but then you can use a 20 pound tank and have one hose that you could hook to your big buddy, little buddy, flex buddy, and just have a few more options. For me, my store didn't have that, so I went with the quick coupler version. So once we've picked our hose, the next step is, how do we hook this up safely and get this guy running to get the shop warm? Well, to do that, you're simply going to click this link right here to get to the next video that'll show you that. Or if you don't have time, click that logo to subscribe and come back later.